Hello AOS fans, it's me Pete and I've got a little one-off game here for you. It's part of our Patreon only TTS tournament. Um, this game I'm up against Gavin and his Thunderix Profiteers. Now I've got my Nurgle, I've hacked around the deck slightly, I've definitely got rid of the Trilobe and I've got rid of the whole idea of standing on objectives and not going anywhere and I've gone for all out offence. So let's see how I get on. Right, so it's time to roll, see who gets to go first. And uh, I get an extra built in crit because I finished second up first. Or right, I think crits. you've got a good chance here. Three crits, or two crits and two singles. I saw that first crit. <laughs> Not bad, but right. you. Yep. Right, so. I think I will go first. Okay. Um, and I will. Well, for my first go, I'm going to charge with Golgok 1 2 to there. Thank you. Have a go at poor old Garrod. So, Golgok does roll three hammers, two damage. Oh, fantastic. Not a thing. Oh, oh, oh I'm guy for you. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Um, well, that's me. I've got nothing in the power step. Right. Right. I'll just go first. I'll take my turn first. I mean, before I play anything. Okay. So Dead Island is going to just charge one. Just the one. And shoot Golgoth. Yes. Ah, you've got one there for me. There you go. Okay. So, two for hammers. And single assists. And he's got a uh, cleave as well. He starts oh. to cleave. I've got a crit. Oh. So I need a crit. A shield yeah, we need a crit and a little hammer anyway. No. So how much damage is that? That's just one damage. Oh, crap. So my, my damage reduction does nothing. Yeah. Well, and I'll push you back. Yep. One there. Nice. Anything in your power step? I will play prepared possession. Ooh. And it basically just puts a guard token on someone. Ooh. So I'll put guard token on Dead Island. Nice. Okay. Do. Yeah. Okay, I've got nothing to play, so I pass. Back to you. Oh, really? Yeah. Um, I wasn't lying when I said I had a handful of upgrades. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> hmm. I'm going to... Ah, I'll just do it. I'll play Toxic Gases on Fecula. Oh, what's that do? That's... Is it Pusher 1? Uh, you... One? Yeah, either take a damage, or I get to push her two hexes, up to two hexes. Two? Okay, I'll take the damage then, because she's two hexes away there from a, a lethal yeah. hex anyway, so... I'd rather she stayed in position. Okay. I still pass. And I will pass as well. Okay, right. Second activation, come on Septimus. I'm going to charge with Septimus. And he's going to go one, two, three over to here. And he's also going to have oh, a go yeah. at old Garrod. So this time it's only two hammers. <coughs> or oh, crit. Oh. And a shield. So that's two okay. damage. Right, I th he's on three, I think, isn't he? You, yes, so he's got one left. Oh, it's Alan for that. Yeah, he's dead. I'm thinking of Dead Island. Yeah, no, he's I'm a dodge and good. he's dead. Right, so I get a glory for that one. And I score Surge of Aggression because I get the Primacy Token, which I didn't mention at the start, but I kind of figure everyone's probably playing for the Primacy Token. Yeah. So I get the prime. I think token. everyone is just now. I think you've got to. Well, in uh, in um, Vanguard. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And yep. I'm going to score surge of aggression as well, which is score immediately after you gain the primacy token, and uh, friendly fighters attack action. But sorry, you can get it after you just score get the primacy token. So I get the glory for that as well. You you've got a brilliant deck. Well, it's, I mean that was that was I was banking on that one I had I had to get that that kill or else I was screwed. In the power step 
I'm going to put scavenged armor on Golgok, which is plus one uh, wound, and puts him on guard. I'm not playing anything. Okay, uh, I am not going to play anything else, I don't think. Okay. Right. Iron Hill's going right in the corner, and he's going to have a shot at the butcher. Take a pot shot at old Golgot there. So I need swords. Three swords, though. Oh. I got nothing. Yes. That's oh. awesome. That was like my first attempt. And I'm not playing a card. Okay. Uh, I'm not going to play a card either. On my third card, I'm just going to draw a power card. Okay. And then I've got nothing to do in my power step. So it's on to your... Uh, it was up to you if you want to play thing or onto your third go. Nope. I'll go to my third go. Um, I will. I'll just um, attack with Dratskir. Okay. Charging over there on so, a gold another gold. charge. And do you think he's two for hammers? Just checking. Yep. Two hammers do damage. I do not like that. Yep. He's already been damaged by one, hasn't he? Golgok's already taken a wound. He did get one back from Scavenged Armor, though, and that puts him on guard. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So he did. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Have you got my dice? That's brilliant. Though? You got my dice, I think. <laughs> okay. That was exciting. <laughs> right, I will play nothing. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to... I think I'll play this now. I'm going to play Unnatural Vitality, which is a cycle card, which effectively gives me plus one move to the end of the round. Or oh, I yeah, yeah. play another cycle, so just plus one move, basically. Actually, I think that card is quite good for them. It certainly seems they're so slow, yeah. Yeah. Uh, anything for you? Nope. Okay, so nothing else for me. It's on to my fourth and final go. I'm just going to charge Fecula one, two, three, four up to there. And I'm going to zap right. that Kazgan. Right, okay. So it's two spell dice, but she does need swirlies on it. And I don't get assists at all. Because you don't get assists on spell dice. One swirly. I never actually knew that. It's all lightnings and swirlies. No assists. Right, okay. So just the one swirly. Right. So he's on shields. Uh -huh. Oh, hey, that must be probably... about the sixth single assist you've rolled. <laughs> that's terrific. Aye, uh, and that's just the one damage though. So... And I will, I will push him back. Okay. So any cards? No, nothing for me. Hey, nothing for me. All right. Your fourth and final go. Right, I went and charged with other ones, so I suppose. Over the big boy. I'll charge with Sandrick. Oh dear. I'll shoot at Golgoch. Yep. Is he two hammers? Is it two damage or one damage? Uh, just the one. Okay. Dem at the moment. Let's see. Oh, yes! Man. Two hammers. That's brilliant! <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, oh dear. Right, here we go. No. So, so there's one damage. Another damage to him. And um, I've scored steady aim. Whee. Only getting successes. Yay! Woo! You can inspire someone off that. Uh, I'll inspire the, the main dude. Thundrick. Oh, Thundrick. Oh, draw another card. I'm going to play Ancestral Fortune, actually. Oh, yeah. I'm going to put it on drag skewer. So he's I'm got an extra wound. Okay. So he's up to four wounds now at the minute. Yep. Cool. Um, I have. Uh, I might as well place now. I'm going to put Hulking Physique on Golgok, which effectively. So that gives him minus one move, plus one wound, and plus one damage. Oh. So he's back up to four. <laughs> he is back up to four again. Okay. <laughs> I've been shooting the wrong person. <laughs> uh, back to you. I'm not playing another card. Nope. 
Okay, I've got nothing else to play either, so that's the end of the first round. Yep. That was you first. Yes, it was. I have only scored one. I've scored Awesome Predator because I have the primacy token at the end there. That goes back well, to the middle. I got Dead Jammy, as we say in Scotland. <laughs> uh, I got Dominant Position. I just drew it up. Oh, is that the one? And I'm on one objective. You're on none. Nice. So um, that was a bit lucky. Beautiful. Uh, I'm going to... I'm not going to get rid of either of my other objectives. I'm going to put... I'm going to put Formidable Defense on Fecula, which is minus one, plus one defense, and minus one um, attack dice. Right. It's, it's, um, it's minus one dice from her attack action, so her spell attack action will also get minus one dice on it. I'll keep the yeah. other two cards, and I'll just drop one objective and three power cards. Over to your. Right, I also scored um, Live by the Code. Oh, yeah. Nice. Like the e easiest card ever. It's nice sometimes yeah. to have those guarantees. Well, you want things like that so I can inspire people. Exactly. I'll inspire uh, Dead Island. Well, you've got. Uh, so, Dead Eyes inspired. Who did you And inspire? Drag Skewer as well. I did yeah. that while you were talking. Oh, sorry, mate. <laughs> right. And I'll get rid of Sound Finances. Yeah, that's a tougher one, that. Um, it's it's all right at the end, but if you get it the first round, um, I'm going to get rid of energy drain because you're not really going on objectives. Um, I've got rid of scavenge armor as well, just because all my guys are in my bit. So, oh, yeah, that's true. That is a tougher one when you're when you're sitting back. <laughs> so you're drawn up and ready. Yep. Okay. I'll just roll. Round two. I've got a double. double and a single. Righty. What can I get? Oh, I got a crit. There you go. I've got a crit. So, I will go first. Right. Uh, for my first go, then. Oh, what do I do? Mm. I'm going to charge over here with Golgok. At uh, Enric Ironhale. Yeah, he's easy to kill. He's he's trapped, and that's that's the main thing for me at the minute. I think so. Golgok is three hammers and two damage, but he's plus one damage, so he's up to three damage right now. Did you get your point for your primacy? I oh, that. I didn't. Sorry. Um, thank you yeah. for pointing that out. Uh, I just looked at it and was like, oh yeah, you had that. Ah, I forgot about that. Uh, so there's a crit and hammer there. Uh, I think he's dead. <laughs> uh, how many defense yeah. dice he got? He's got one dodge. Ah, okay, yeah. I'm afraid he's been splattered. So you get primacy again? I get the primacy again. Um, everyone inspires. That's brilliant. Um, and I'm going to play Thriller the Hunt, which is play after an attack action. That takes an enemy out of action. I gain the primacy token, which I did anyway, and I can heal yeah. somebody or push somebody. Um, yeah. I will push him back one there. Check. They are coward. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, because <laughs> I can't. I can't really get him there, can I? No, because the block tax. No, I'd no. have to move. That's that's pretty much why. Just so you can't just sit there jabbing at him for <laughs> for four turns or something. Okay. Uh, in the power step, I'm going to do something. I'm going to put... So everyone's inspired now. I'm going to put Living Plague uh, on Septimus. Which is... Um, basically, if you're attacking with a range 1 attack, uh, I roll a dice and on a shield or a crit, you, you take 1 damage. It has to be a successful yeah. range one attack on me. So you know, if you attack range one attack me and miss, then it doesn't matter. Anything for you? I'm going to play etheric augmentation. I get plus one dice next turn mm. for attacks. Oh dear. Okay. Uh, I've got nothing else to play. Oh, I won't use it. Don't worry. I'm not going to attack. <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, I've got nothing else. I'm going to play Seek the Sky Vessel. Ooh, that's and move, move two people. Nice. So, actually, I need to move one because the other ones are in range. Yeah, that's true. I'm just going to put drag sphere here. So as a move. Uh, that's that's it for me. I've got nothing. Right, so I'll attack. I think I may actually attack. No, I'm just going to attack the butcher. I've got info. Kazgam. No, is he? Is he made a charge? There's a charge token there. Yeah, yeah, he charged yeah. Um, thingy in the corner. Oh, right, and yeah, I used his ability him, to then. move him oh. back. <laughs> no, Gogol's not going anywhere now for a while. No, I'm going to attack Fekula. It will drag you. Okay, no. Whacking her in the face with his spear, I guess. Yeah, and it's got three damage. Three damage? Yowza. Okay. Yeah. I really like Drax here when he inspires. He gets gets it going. That's of a hit, though. But that is always the problem. Oh, there's, there's one. Hey, one. Okay, so she does have two defense now because of her formidable defense. Oh, yep, one defense. Got it. Um, okay, you can push it back if you want. Um, I don't know if there's any point. No, I'll leave her there. Okay. Anything in your power step? Not at the moment, no. Okay. Um, I am not going to do anything right now either. Um, no, I won't do anything right now. So my, my second go, I'm just going to zap at Deadeye with Fecula. Right, okay. Um... I might use her. Actually, I'm going to use her staff because she rolls three hammers on her staff, so it, it gets reduced to two yeah. hammers. So it's two hammers. Um, really good. I don't know why. That's dirty. That's disgusting. I'm it's not just sure. Just a, a wooden stick. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, one crit. A crit. Okay. Yeah, that's so. I think I've had the rub of the green on the dice with this one. Uh, nothing. Just a dodge. So that's that's oh. two damage. Ah. Huh? That's two damage. I'll I'll leave him there though. No, actually, I'm gonna okay. I'll push him back one onto that starting hex there for no reason. Cards, these things. What am I meant to be doing? Um, no, I haven't got anything to do. Sorry, thank you. I'm going to put fearsome trapping trappings on Draxgur. Okay. Uh, I still power step past, so it's over to your uh, second go. Right, I'm I'm passing. Right, I'll just attack <laughs> Fakula again. Me as well. Yeah, with uh, Kazgam. Yeah. Yep. Sorry, it's a stupid question. Of course, she said again. Oh my word. That was what, brilliant. What have you done to the dice? What have you made? <laughs> what, what have you done to those poor dice? I know what it is. I'll they, fix it. Don't worry. They, they don't like you. There we go. I'm much better now. <laughs> um, no, nothing. Pink dice roll hotter. Is that it? Yep. Uh, I'm going to put Virulent Blade on um, Septimus, which effectively allows him to re-roll one attack dice. Uh, nothing else for me, so my third gun, I'm going to charge with Septimus to there. How dare you. And I'm going to have a stab at old Deadeye there. There's two hammers. Um, hold on a second. Oh, oh I'm going to play Hope Sink. Oh no, I forgot about that. <laughs> you only so, did that like two minutes ago. Because <laughs> he, he just moved. I was yep. forgetting he had to move first. So I'll put on Septimus. Okay. He's got a minus one defense. Alright. Boogie. And he's right, a quarry, got... isn't he? Yeah, yeah I'll, I'll take that card. I'll stick it over here so I don't I don't forget it. Aye, that's I'm, right. I'm very liable to forget otherwise. Just and it's not like in the real world. Right. You can take care of everyone's cards and, and no one's going to get precious about people touching your card. <laughs> yeah. Because it's all virtual. <laughs> Okay, poo, right, so he's minus one defence. Okay, so, um, he's two hammers and I can re-roll one. Oh, wrong three dice there, let me delete those and try again. That's how I'm, that's how I'm winning, I'm just rolling more dice than I'm allowed to. Ah, uh, that's your secret. Oh, nothing, okay, I'll try re-rolling one. Oh, crap. I've rolled I've a lot. I've seen you blow that over. You blew that over. <laughs> <laughs> oh. That didn't roll. No, that didn't roll properly. Oh. Right, a shield, so he's got a hit. Oh, okay. So that's two so, damage. That'll be two damage, I take it. Yep. 
Yeah, he's dead. You're an honest man. If also a very unlucky man. Um, I was lucky last night. <laughs> oh, was it? Did you use it all it up last night? It just scores like that. Yep. I also score pitiable death because um, the enemy fight was on a starting hex. Oh, yeah. Of course. Yep. Uh, so pick up a new card. I haven't got anything else to play. So it's over to you. Alright. I'll attack. Um, what's his face? Septimus. Septimus. This time. But I'm going to shoot him with Thundrick instead just now. Oh, it's two damage, isn't it? Yep. And it's got cleave. And I've only got one defense dice. Oh, Septimus. Yep. You're in trouble. Well, we'll see. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm in the crap. Yay! See, pink. I'm pink. Gonna, yeah, pink roll. <laughs> pink roll will. Ah, oh, a shield. So it does reduce yeah, the damage still... by one. Yay. So it's only a one damage. It's just one damage. You can push him back if you want. I will push him back. Yeah, I'll push him there. Jump. Okay. Uh, anything in your power step? I'm not playing anything. Okay. I'm... I'm not going to play anything either. So on to my fourth go. With I'm Fecula. With Fecula. I'm just going to... I'm not sure I want to get close to you, so I'm just going to take a, a swing at Kazgan from there. Uh, with no. Fecula. That's a silly idea. <laughs> so it's two hammers, normally three, but minus one because of her formidable defense oh look at that beauty two swords not a sausage ah well never mind happens uh, yep. and I've got nothing in my power step I not playing anything ok on to your fourth go right I'll charge here one two three and I'll shoot steps in this Okay. There you go. Oh, you've got one. Okay. Copy and paste for the win. Come on, the pink. Oh. Yeah, that was brilliant. Right, come on, Bjorgen. Okay. Come on, Bjorgen. Why are you playing that? Right. It had cleave and everything. Okay. Yeah. Your dice, that was a round definite, for me. your dice have definitely taken it upon themselves to do you rotten tonight. That's <laughs> uh, it's not as if I can qualify for the group anymore. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's sometimes right, it gets to a point where it's just about the pride of it. You're just like, come on, you yeah. freaking dice. Uh, anything in your power step? Yeah, I'll just put it on Drax. Yeah, uh, savage speed. Ooh, okay. Uh, I am going to put. The feral symbiote on to sexy puss, I think. Which effectively gives him plus one damage and he'll start gaining hunger tokens. Uh, nothing else for you? No. Okay, nothing else for me either, so that's the end of that round. I think you were first again. I was, yeah, I've been getting all the cut, all the dice that I want on this one. So I have scored Faithful Reward, which is have um, inspired fighters. If all my surviving friendly fighters are inspired, and I've scored Chosen yep. Warriors, which is one or more surviving friendly fighters and three or more enemy fighters out of action, so I've scored three in total. I'm going to keep my last card. I'm going to get rid of my power card, which is the Burgeoning, which is a cycle card that gives me a wound back. And I'm going to draw up two objectives and five power cards. Okay. Uh, over to you. I've scored nothing. Oh. I'm going to get rid of Pitiable Death. Absolute Dominance. Um, I'm going to keep the other one. They're tough cards against the Worms Bat, especially when your dice decide that you're not going to be able to hit anything. <laughs> so I'm to roll for that fourth round. Is that fourth round? Third round. Let's see what I get. Oh, nothing. Yes. <laughs> Not a thing. So right, I've got something, do. that's all I needed. I'm assuming you're going first. Uh, yes, I'll go first. Hulk it all. 
I'll be better just shooting them. There's more chance. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Not, not using those charge token. Okay. Yeah, especially with Thundric, because he, he's the two hammers, two damage king. Yeah, I've got a cleave in that. So, Ooh, one hammer. One hammer, so I do need a crit. Yes. Oh, oh a hammer. <laughs> so that, that okay. doesn't... Um, so that reduces the damage by one, so I take one from that, and then I presume you're knocking him onto the lethal for a second? Yes. Right. So you still got one left. Still got one left. I need that. That hammer nah. was was key, basically. Anything in your power step? I'm going to put ancestral mate on Draxkier. Oh, so it's plus one, one damage to range one and two. Oh dear. Okay, I'm going to attempt to cast Hungry Bolt, which is just a spell right. with one swirly, and if it casts, I scatter from the caster three hexes. Anybody under one of those hexes takes a wound, so I'll, I'll see if I can oh, yeah, cast yeah. it before anything else. So I need a swirly here. Ah, oh, there is a swirly. Okay. So I'll place the scatter token facing that way towards Kazgan, and I'll roll three dice and see what I get. And I was a bit, two I was a bit oh no, not a crit. So, uh, so I'll do two hammers, and that will hit Kazgan. And then the crit will just go off to the side. So that just does it's just one damage to Kazgan. Anything for you in the power step? I'll just play it now. I'll play the best card ever: Ferocious Resistance. Oh, oh dear! And that was going on, um, old Kazgan, I presume. Yeah. Assume you want a couple of. It's only two wins, but you know. There's some magic dice for you. Yeah, I was just thinking I don't have any. <laughs> right. That is a problem, yeah. Oh, yeah. One. Right, so he loses right. that wound okay. that I just did to him. So that's, oh. that's okay, right? Yeah, it's not bad. Yep. I will then play Unstoppable Tread on Golgok. Which is effectively after an activation, I could push him one hex. All right, okay. Back to your good self. I'm not playing a card. And I am not going to play anything either. So for my first activation, I'm just going to draw a power card. Oh. Oh, that's okay. not. That's not the power card I wanted. I don't think. So I am in the. I'm not going to do anything. I'm not doing anything either. Okay. On your second goal. So I'll attack with Drax Skewer. Yep. And I'll just take Fecula. Hook it all. I mean, you could shoot her with Bjorgen, but I think you're better off with Drax Skewer, aren't you? Because yeah, he does three damage. Well, so, if yeah. I manage to hit her, then I'll kill her. <laughs> uh, yeah, unless I, roll, unless, I roll, yeah, unless I roll shield, yeah. Yeah. Oh god. Uh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are these dice doing? Right, that's that's shocking. That is disgusting. <laughs> Anything in your power step, other than deleting all of the dice and starting again? Um, no. Okay. Um, I am not going to do anything either. Uh, actually, yeah, I'm going to put the Sharik claws onto Sexpus. So oh, effectively, yeah. he's a quarry uh, and has cleave. Yeah, that's good against my guys. Yep. Yep. Um, okay. Nothing for you? Nope. Okay, so my second go, I'm then going to charge Sexypus 1, 2, 3 to there. So I'm going to go at Kazga and Drax Skewer. Right. So Sexypus rolls two hammers, can re roll one of them, and it's four damage. That's a okay. hammer and a oh and Oof. a crit. So can't do anything about that. I've got I've got yeah. So that is four damage. Right. <laughs> and that's when you roll well. the crit, of course. <laughs> that that really so four is it? That is four damage, because he got three base and then he's got the feral symbiote which is plus one, which does get him a a, uh, a hunger token as well. 
Yeah, so he's dead, isn't it? He is. Uh, and oh, I scored well. turned tables, which is score immediately after a quarry takes an enemy fighter out of action. Gives me two glory. Bye. Right, okay. Um, in the power step, I haven't got anything that I want to do. I will do nothing. Okay, on to your third go. I, I think I'm just going to draw a card. Okay. There we go. And anything to play? Uh, no, this would be even better for Drax Gear. Ah. Okay, uh, nothing to play, no. Hokey dokey. I'm not going to do anything. It's on to my third go. I'm just going to move Golgok 1 2 to there. And then after his activation, I'm going to use his Unstoppable Tread to push him one more hex there. And that's it. Nothing of a power step. Right, so. I'll just charge up here. Walk it all. And I'll shoot at Septimus. Walk it all. Come on, Thundrick. Right. Come on, Thundrick. <laughs> You're actually cheering them on. <laughs> I don't think they rolled. They seem to stop. So you can re-roll them if you want. I think I pushed the wrong button. Oh, okay. Oh, there's a hammer. A hammer. With cleave. So I'll I do, do need a crit or sexy puss goes down. No, that hammer is not enough. Sex puss is out of there. That's a, a glory there. Wow. Nice. I will spend that with the magma drop, so it's one less hit you would get. Oh, yeah. On, on Thundrick. I have. Um, I've got nothing I want to play, so I don't know if you've got anything else. Eh, uh, no, I'm fine. Okay. I don't know if it's worth me. I don't think it's worth me attacking on this last turn. I've got I've got loads of cards, and none of them are much use to me right now. So I'm going to get rid of an objective on my last go. I'm going to get rid of Savage Exemplar, which is kill someone with my leader, and draw an objective. Anything in your power step? I've got nothing. Eh, hey, nothing. Okay. Uh, so on to the end phase, and you sure. went first. I went first. So I had headshot, but I never got a crit. Oh. I had awesome predator, but you killed Dragskier. <laughs> oh no. And if you actually hit someone, I would have scored then <laughs> that one as well. Oh god. I would have scored all three. You would have scored. But I scored none. If you'd have got like a crit attack off at one point, you possibly would have scored all three in one go. I could have, yeah. Oh jeez. Well, one of them's in the end phase, but you know, I would have got it. Yeah. That's just that's just horrible. I have. I've scored, um, I've only scored aggressive display, which is what I just picked up, which is scoring in phase of two or more enemy fighters are out of action. So that's it. Okay. That's all I've got. I think they are. Yep. <laughs> yeah. So what you got, 13? That's uh, not bad, eh? 13 to 5, yeah. Hey, those dice were, I know I've said it several times, but uh, I think in the first round you rolled about seven or eight single assists, it felt like. Yeah. Yeah, okay, it happens. Eh? Yeah, it happens. I, that's one of the things I'm trying to work out with this game. Is it's it, it's it's quite swingy, and I think it's more swingy because um, I was waiting for you to roll four crits. Then um, <laughs> I was just testing. It. Yeah, just in case. I, I think this game's obviously because it's d6, and because if you play offense, you need to get those attacks off and those hits to land. It can be really swingy, yeah. and. I can't work out if the, if the game would work better if you if it got converted to like D10 or D12 or something like that. Yeah, I don't know. It might make it even worse. Possibly. I don't know. It's it's more it's the not um, many more pieces on the die. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, it's hard to tell, and I think at the minute because everybody's playing an offensive game because of Diachasm and the Vanguard sort of meta. I think because everybody's yeah. playing mostly offense or maybe a slight flex offense deck, once one person starts to get the dice go their way a little bit, it just sort of landslides for you because you just you start getting more fighters or you start getting glory, you get the upgrades, and your opponent when they don't get those rolls, it just goes completely against them. Mm. And it's just yeah, yeah, horrific. just the way it is there. Yeah, but um, but then I was too much the other way then. You just need to get the balance in between. Yeah, yeah, definitely. If there's too much objectives, then everybody complains about that. 
Yeah, I, I was issues and things like that. Yeah, I was I was trying to work out like what I wanted to see in this season, and I wanted to see a bit more of a return to sort of like the flex play. I didn't want people just playing solely aggro or solely objective, and I think they started to do that. Some of the cards which are like. Um, I think you scored one of them, which is like hold more objectives than your opponent. So it's not hold two or yeah. hold three or anything like that. It's just hold more, and then it becomes a little bit yeah. more tactical because you can do that by just scoring with one objective sometimes, that kind of thing. I actually love that card because it's so many aggressive war bands, and uh, you just need to hop onto one objective sometimes, like I did. Yeah. And that's too, too boy. I actually really like that card. Yeah, and, and with things like. Um, Slick Rock and Power Drain, or whatever it's called, Energy Drain. Offensive yeah. Warbands tend to avoid the objectives even more because they don't want to go near them in case they get Slick Rocked off or they get um, Energy Drained or something like that. So yeah. it gives you even more chance then to um, to just jump on one objective at some point and score it. Yeah, that happened in my first game uh, against Matt Set the Tempo. Played yeah. Energy Drain on Draxgear. Oh. And he had, I had like more. Well, a few upgrades. I was doing well at that point. A few upgrades that I was just going to wipe out, hopefully wipe out Scaif, but I couldn't move him. <laughs> so I just took the wrong warband. <laughs> I mean, it looks like it. We've we've had one of our other games in this <laughs> tournament. Yeah, was was played out between Thundrix and the Eyes, and the Eyes managed to give Thundrix a, a drumming net on that game as well. So maybe Thundrix in this meta aren't aren't as good as we thought they might be. Yeah. I just figured they're a good all-round warband, so I thought, oh, yeah, I'll just go there. <laughs> I think they are. I think you were you're quite unlucky because those three cards you've got there as well. You, you know, you you kind of want those earlier, especially things like headshot. Yeah, headshot. Um, yeah, you get that the first round, and you can get that straight away sometimes. Yeah, although I mean, one of the good things about eyes, uh, not eyes, one of the good things about worms pack is it's quite hard for my opponents to score grab the supremacy token cards because it's quite hard to one shot the four wound fighters but it's it's still yeah tricky and I was yeah. fortunate as well that every time you kept pinging wounds off of Golgok I had um, you know I had a card that I could uh, basically negate that wound that you've given him I gave him scavenged armor and then I gave him um, hulking physique to, to keep just removing those wounds from and keeping on that four wound which doesn't help you. Yeah, and uh, look, you should have not done that and let me just have it. <laughs> it's fair, you know, that's not very nice. <laughs> yeah, sorry, dude. I keep forgetting yeah. in this game that going for the leader is sometimes better because you get the, you get the, um, the primacy. You get, you get the primacy, yeah, just for killing the leader. They don't, it doesn't matter if they're wounded yeah. to start with. I you always forget that. One shot them, yeah. Yeah, and I keep, I forget that in every game I play almost. Yeah. In, I mean, some war bands like with with the Thundrix, you don't want to be going after the leader because he's tough as nails. But there's a lot of other war bands out there where taking out the leader is no more difficult than taking out a lot of other members. So it's worth it just for that. Yeah. Some like Miaris. Yeah. 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 They're not that hard. Yeah, yeah Miaris. Played, gets... uh, played with the Slanesh with a uh, Mal Vassalite died straight away. So. Yeah, yeah. Well, I played a game against Robin where I was the Slanish guys, and he took out, he took out Vaseline like second turn with a charge from um, yeah. Kagra. It's just oh, okay. So he's dead then. Yeah, that's about <laughs> like why well, I was like, yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, cheers for the game, dude. Uh, that was uh, it. Was good in a way. <laughs> yeah. Sorry about the dice. They really did you dirty on that one. But um, I mean, I'm hoping we should be getting towards. Uh, getting past the playoffs soon in this tournament, and then once we get the you know the semi-finals and all the rest of it, and the finals out of the way, we can then start season two. Right, cheers, dude. Well, thank you very much for the game. Thank you, sir. And I'm I'm sorry the dice did you dirty, and hopefully we can oh, we can play another game when and they'll play a little bit nicer next time. See ya. Bye. Bye.